So today I will be unboxing the Xbox One X, the most powerful gaming console in the world. Perhaps I'm a little late to the party though, because it was released some time ago, but I still wanted to make an unboxing video nonetheless. So when I pulled it out of the box, I did notice that it was a lot heavier than the Xbox One S that I have right now, but that is to be expected considering how much power it packs. So what's included is the HDMI cord, the controller, paperwork, power cable, and some other boring papers. Batteries included, which is good. The Xbox itself is slightly different from the previous Xbox One S, but to an untrained eye, it's not gonna be a big difference. The front of it has some sensors, a button, and the disc eject button, as well as the thing where you put the discs in. Right side has some cooling vents, and it's mirrored on the other side. The back has all the important ports, including the power port, as well as a couple of HDMI ports, and some other stuff. Setting it up was easier than ever, pretty much what you would expect, and it also has this nice special animation. So I did run Call of Duty World War II on it, and it runs much better in my 4K TV, I tell you that. Um, I do have a 4K display, and I do notice the difference between 4K and 1080p. So, if you are wondering if you want to get it, if you have a 4K TV, go for it. It does make the gameplay a lot more crispier and much more beautiful looking. So that is it for this unboxing and mini review. Thank you very much for watching, and I do recommend this product. Go ahead and buy it if you want it. And I'll see you next time. Thank you very much for watching.